Okay, so I had planned a spectacular video for this, but for right now, we're just going to suffice to say that the Pie Girl is totally operational with attract mode. And that's what the, the best part in the world is about this, is uh, you actually get video. And further than that, you actually have HDMI out. So if you had an HDMI cable plugged in right now, you would actually be seeing exactly what you see on this screen right now. And this is the 3.2 inch. And one of the other things, this stick right here is actually true analog. And you can, uh, you can use it to navigate the menu also. If I can, either or, you can use either to navigate the menu. Digital. And you can see here too, the power socket. You don't have to build this kit with batteries. You can actually just build it with the Teensy and plug straight in. That way you don't have to spend the extra, oh, I don't know, 25 bucks to make it battery powered. So those are the highlights. And, uh, oh, and, haha, I got the printed circuit boards in too. So this kit is easy peasy, in my opinion. Maybe a little bit more complex than the average uh, Joe is ready for. But if you know anything about attract mode, you also know that all of these displays are configurable. And if I hit the, oops, that, that launched the game. <laughs> you hit start and select together to get out. And if I hit just select, you can actually go through the, uh, the menu, I'm trying to get it to focus and change the displays and everything. So that's the overview of the Pi Gear. All right, bye.